very delayed with uh, the LA Girl product, but I finally got a chance to buy all of the LA Girl products. So I'm going to try it out and I'm going to do a full face with you and let's see how that goes. LA Girl Pro Prep High Definition Smoothing Face Primer is what I bought and I'm literally going to put a little dose like that on my finger and I've got a little bit of like a pause showing here so what I'll do is I'll just put it with my fingers like this and just use a tapping motion to kind of place the primer in the pores. I chose LA Girl in the color Soft Honey and I'm hoping it's the right match. So let's see, try this baby out. So let's put one squirt. Whoa, that's a lot. It's a little bit runny. I don't know if this is gonna be my color guys, but let's see. Okay, my sponge has been damp, wet already and spots on my face I'm not really a foundation person as you know especially for work I generally like to you know put some fixed powder and that's my day but I thought let's just try this out and see how it goes I probably have to add more to give me a more full coverage but this isn't too bad then I'm going to take my Pro Concealer, this is in the color beige, I think, creamy beige. And I'm literally going to put a little bit, I have this at home already, so this is a brand new one, but I didn't carry it. And I don't put too much concealer, I just use a little to brighten up the area. I don't like it to feel cakey also, you know. So I put very little, unless I'm going to a wedding or I'm dancing on stage. And what I didn't try out is actually contouring my face with a darker color concealer. So I got this color in the color Beautiful Bronze. For the sake of this video, I thought, why not give it a try and see how it turns out. didn't get anything for my eyebrows just going to use my essence eyebrow pencil and quickly do my eyebrows eyebrows done and not the greatest of jobs but we are getting there and then I got this nude palette oh, it comes with a little brush this is gorgeous how about we go with this creamy color here first going to apply it in the natural crease of my eye let's go with this brown this darker brown here for the corners so it's a little shimmery but that's okay a little shimmers okay pencil liner which is called LA Girl Line Art Matte Eyeliner and it has like a thing in it looks quite fancy Big bold mascara 
says that apparently it's supposed to elongate the lash and make it look longer. to get the desired look but it's still working and it's not it's not the best but it's also not bad as well maybe let's go with the bronzy shimmer and I just want to highlight my corners real quick and highlight Oh, that's got a lot of pigment. Let's use my finger there. And then I got this nude color lipstick. It is in, it's a cream lipstick. It's called Kiss and Tell. It's really beautiful. I like the color. Ooh. This is a nice color. It smells, it smells divine. And it feels like velvet. I didn't put any primer on my lips, so it really moisturized my lips and still gives it that matte look. I really like it. Well done, LA girl. Now, setting spray, this is the high definition setting spray, long lasting matte finish. So this is the look and I'm really happy with how it turned out. I feel like my skin is not heavy even though I have a full face makeup. I am in love with this lipstick and I love the shimmery colors on the eyeshadow palette. So far so good. I'm probably going to become a really big fan of LA Girl. I'm going to show you a little bit later on how my skin looks. I'm going to try and not touch up. and. Let's see how it goes. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And give this video a thumbs up if you think it was a cool video. And I really hope you liked it. Bye everyone. Hey everyone, I'm just doing a check. It's now 2 p.m. and my skin still feels fresh. It hasn't gotten oily on my T-zone. Um, my eye makeup is still intact. My lipstick hasn't been... Um, I, I drank coffee, I had a sandwich, I <sighs> walked a lot and still my makeup is feeling fresh everything's looking really nice and breezy it's like i just did it um so i'm very very happy with the results so far and i'm gonna check in a little bit later to see how this makeup did remember i didn't bake my face so if you can see as i smile it's literally you know fine nothing's crazy maybe a little shiny but Still fresh for me personally maybe other people will feel that they need to powder up and things I haven't done anything I like the fact that it's now looking a little bit more natural so I'm excited to see the results a little bit later so we'll do a check-in maybe after 6 p.m. or so so it's now 25 to 6 and this is my face after I applied the makeup on at 9 o'clock so after a good few hours it's obviously a little bit more shiny now 
um, but it still looks great um, it's it's really blended into my skin and I still I can still you know put a little bit more lipstick and go out and I'll be comfortable um, I must say that LA girl has really really done a good job and I'm really a big fan of it now